What are you doing, physics? Physics. Go home, physics. You're drunk. Freeze! Oh, finally. Someone who ain't trying to kill me. You ain't trying to kill me, too, right? <laughs> right, okay. Well, from the looks of it, you got an eye for the finer things in life. Of course. Check this out. How did you get no blood on your shirt, Open on your vest? Second. But, holy crap. Here it is, Doc. The mother of <laughs> I, I am so I sorry for shooting you three seconds ago. But you don't have the glue on gun. You do have useless satchel church. <gasps> Yay. You do have freaking depleted uranium stuff. Not sure why they would have that here, but whatever. Also, you know it's weird? The glue on gun and stuff, they use depleted uranium. Even though they should use um, what's the word for not depleted uranium? You know, active, fissile, whatever the crap. The uranium that doesn't... <laughs> I guess I can kill you now. Um, but, yeah. Freaking Windows 95. Um, but, yeah. Guns! Oh, on a totally random note unrelated to the current moment in the story, the bow actually works pretty damn well in this game. I remember it being crappy in the first, in, you know, in the original Half-Life. But, um, it seems to be more or less a one-hit kill, just like it is in Half-Life 2 in this game. So, I don't know if they boosted up the damage, or if I just remembered wrong, but pretty good. The only annoying thing is the scope is so sensitive, I want to say, I guess. Like, I don't know. It it really limits your field of view. It would, I did not expect to be on a ladder there. So, there's probably three guys up here. Inside this door. Guys. Somewhere. To shoot. I know you're here or somewhere. I wanted to shoot you. Demonstrate the gun. The one time I want to see those stupid military assholes. Another thing is the um the Marines seem way stronger or deadlier or something than they were in the in the original Half-Life. Cause I remember them being not quite a joke, but not really oh. Nice night vision goggles you got there, asshole. You need some situational awareness training. Yeah. Hey, hey, hey. Speaking of situational awareness training. Um the hell? Freaking cubicle wall just attacked me. This is why offices are evil, people. Cubicle walls try to eat your face. It's it's just not cool. Why do they keep saying do it? That that like partial Nike salesman, but not entirely. Also, the bolts bounce off of stuff, which seems highly useless, generally speaking. But it lets you know when your shot missed, at least. Let's see if there are any secrets up here. Well, I don't need to be recording. Oh, the irony. Also, is that giant painting on the wall really necessary for no smoking? Anyway. One comment I wanted to make, in the original Half-Life 2, the uh, holes in floors all really looked very, very unconvincing. And that's not a problem at all in this mod. It's They're really, really well done. What the f Friggin' Vortigons! You guys are supposed to be my friends! Oh shit, alien things. Die. 
kill stuff. I don't need you assholes too. Well, I'm going to go kill these guys. Also, where are my fucking snarks? Where are the snarks? Been through like 50 situations where a snark would have been absolutely awesome. Sit back, let the snark kill these stupid soldiers. My favorite use for the snark, because they're not as great against some of the Zen aliens and stuff. They're not in Zen itself because of the, you know, gaps and stuff. So, where are my snarks? Did I, like, miss the snarks? Is there some early spot to get snarks that I missed, or what the hell? Seriously. Alright, so this whole fight with the frickin' the uh what the hell is that plane called? The VTOL troop transport thingy dingy that drops off a bunch of people and infinitely drops off more of them until you shoot it down with a Tau missile. That that was bullshit and I hated it. Um it was it would have been interesting. What is that sound? Oh my god. Snarks. Snarks. They're so cute. I have to kill them because they'll eat my face. Still there, adorable. The hell was that? No! No! Shit! Were they actually used as enemies in the original game? I don't remember ever seeing them. Like, if you threw them and they didn't have anything to kill, they would attack you. But I mean. That's lovely. This is what a snark den looks like. Yes! Who's a cutie? Isn't he cute? Who's a cutie? I shall name you Jeffrey. Do you hear people to kill Jeffrey? Do you hear the people to kill? Where are the people to kill Jeffrey? You're hungry, aren't you? I'm sure you are. We got 15 and I'm not full yet. That is awesome. I'm pretty sure you got like ah, fucking hey. Oh sh Starks are gonna be no use against that. That is lame. What the hell, Black Mesa? You give me a new awesome gun and you give me no time to use it. And by gun I mean Snarks. More accurately a grenade. But like seriously, what the hell? I was like you have me all pumped, now I'm gonna throw down some freaking what the fuck. But yeah, I thought it would be like, throw down some snarks. Oh, back here already. <laughs> throw some snarks. That was... That was not my best idea ever, I will admit. Um, yeah, I was figuring, you know, you throw down some Stark Slayer, like a sneak attack, and then... Suddenly freaking Gargantua chasing my ass. That's not... That is not using snarks to kill people. It's not remotely close to using Snarks to kill people. Oh well. I have a feeling this is going to be a bitch. I've had low health for the majority of this game. This game seems a lot harder than the original. I'm playing on normal. It's not necessarily a bad thing, though. There have been a couple points that have been kind of BS. Um, namely that... Um, um, the bit with the helicopter. Let's try to run there for a second. Um, yeah, the first helicopter you fight with the rockets, um, I had pretty much full health when I started that, but it still was fairly hard, because I didn't realize there were more rockets in front of me, and even when I did, you know, it was so easy to get killed quickly. I know that Gargantua is not a good thing to be around. Okay, I think I'm going up here. Maybe rocket launcher time. Probably rocket launcher time. Oh, I remember now. Call down an orbital strike on his ass. Um, 
Let me fire the thing before it eats me. I don't care about your whole radio drama here to let me fire the thing. Um, targets, yes. Here. Dark hey. Firing. Hello. Target. No. Move the target to. Not sure what's going on here. Not good with the computer. Like what the hell? One game. Oh. Can drag. Can drag. Guy. Fire button's not working. I'm pretty sure you just pressed like a button. Oh, no. Damn it. Okay. There. It's on him. Fire. You're gonna fire. Yeah, you're hitting your head on the thing. I see that. Oh, I missed it. <laughs> Seriously though, this screen thing is buggy as hell, like, I assume the flickering is not supposed to happen. It would be fine if not for the flickering, but, oh, yes, oh. I thought he was going to hold out his finger and the, the snark tries to eat his finger. That was my favorite animation from the first game. Well, the original game, whatever you want to call it. Um, but you can see your reticle clearly here, and you can see the... You can watch it move, barely, but I mean, A, I was not expecting to, like, just be able to use the fire button. I was figuring I would use the activate, and really there's no reason not to use the activate button. You know, use, or whatever they call it. But, like, you could have just used both. Allowed both for input. Um, are you kidding me? That's not the solution. Currently stuck, but yeah. Well, I'll have to blow stuff up. You heard it. You are so cute. Look at him. record you were supposed to bomb the communication satellite thingy. It's not really what I was expecting. It goes where the original one the Goli yeah, the Gargantua was at a door at the door here. And you bombed him and the door in one go, but this is cool too. I just was like wandering around for a couple minutes like what the hell am I doing now? behind enemy lines. We just missed the last flight out of here. I sure hope you brought some backup for me, Dexter, because we're gonna need it. I sure brought some backup. They're called snarks! Let's get the hell out of here. Long time He's I eating you your legs. Matters, pal. He is eating your legs. Hey! Help me! Not cool, asshole. Would you shoot a kitten? An adorable space alien kitten that's trying to eat your face? Yeah, Would you? Um, no, I cannot spare some morphine. I could spare some snarks, though. Help! Eat him! For Pete's <laughs> sake, eat him! He's glitchy standing on the snark. You know what? You're an asshole. Don't eat me! Don't eat me! Well, that was awkward. Oh, what's that guy got there? Were you in weapons research too? Probably. I built the glue on the gun, 
but I just can't bring myself to use it on another living creature. It doesn't appear that you have any trouble killing things. I sure don't. You can take her with you, but please promise to put her to good use. Ho oh, ho ho. I will. I'm sure I will. Target? Anybody? Hey, buddy! <laughs> Don't let it make a meal of me! <laughs> I won't, buddy. I like you. You make guns. Good Ooh. lord, man! Do you know what you've just done? I killed a horrible monster from another dimension? I'm not sure where you're finding fault with this. Whatever. Uh, something I'm not getting with the glue on gun. So normal fire is that. And switch fire modes. It appears is to do the getting hungry? exact same thing. So like mode one. Mode two. So I don't get what the switching is about. Fat lot of good that PhD does me now, hmm. Um, so yeah, there doesn't seem to be any difference. There's no visual indication that it switched. I could have sworn it fired, like, a continuous stream with one setting and, like, a single big burst Good on the other Lord, setting. Lord, man! Do you know what you've just done? Uh, yeah. Why did you give me the gun if you didn't want me to use it? Anyway. Fantastic! You've got... what? I'm sure you'll have plenty of opportunities to test your... I don't your get you, field, man. But you can practice in the shooting range, if you'd like. You just bitched at me for using the shooting range. Then you congratulated me. This guy has issues. Seriously. Go, go, Gadget! Rocket launcher! Rocket launcher? Rocket launcher! What are you doing? Rocket launcher. This is this is not how you shoot rockets. Rocket launcher, come on. The laser, the, the rocket. Rocket launcher. We talked about this. Hmm. What is this? Science! Holy crap! But I you but ha holy crap! <laughs> voice acting and stuff is actually pretty good on this. Also, I was unfortunately reminded this game still isn't quite complete yet, so I think the Zen chapters are missing. So I'm pretty close. I'm in Lambda Core now, so it will all be over soon, unfortunately. They are working on the rest, though. They're not going to leave it totally unfinished, but they just wanted to publish what they had now because... It had been unfinished for freaking ages already. Well, you taunt me with the portals, but you don't let me get to them. That is just rude. You science tease you. Oh well. 